A baby Gabriel's mother wanted out of jail today, but instead a judge ruled that Elizabeth Johnson will stay put. ABC 15's Corey Rangel is live with today's developments in the case. And uh, Corey, Johnson will be let out at some point, perhaps, or, or what's going to happen here? Well, Elizabeth Johnson will be in jail until at least December 7th, the day the judge set for her sentencing. Now, at today's hearing, the judge even hinted several times he has possible prison time planned for Johnson when she is sentenced, even though she's eligible for probation. Now, a jury convicted Johnson of conspiracy to commit custodial interference charges and unlawful imprisonment for her role in baby Gabriel's disappearance in December of 2009. Now, Johnson's attorney says he'll now focus on getting people to speak on Johnson's behalf at her sentencing, hoping to convince the judge she should be let out. There are lots of people who could come in. I could, I could probably take up the entire afternoon if I wanted to with a parade of witnesses for the defense who could come in and say good, positive things about Elizabeth Johnson. Now, at the time of the sentencing, Johnson will have spent nearly three years behind bars, which the judge will take into consideration. And that's what they were looking for really here is time served based on the conviction on the charges that she already faced. So we'll see. Thank you, Corey.